I swear, if anybody ever seen the outtakes from my intros of these videos, you would think I need some serious help, which I probably do anyway. But anyway, hey guys, Geeky Ghost Guy here, and welcome to another video. And in today's video, we're going to unbox and review the NECA Gremlins Winter 2-Pack. These guys are a Target exclusive. Um, I've already done a, uh, I think it was in my show and tell, my, uh, when I got it or whatnot. But I showed the package there, but we're going to do it again, you know, like we always do. I really love the artwork that NECA puts into their packaging, um, especially like the Gremlins and the new Godzilla packaging is amazing, it's phenomenal. So let's go ahead and crack these guys open. And how freaking cute is that? Take a good look at these guys. Now that we got them out of the packaging, you can see them in all their unpackaged glory. Beautiful paint applications. I love the little stocking cap on this guy. It says NECA. Instead of, I guess it would say Noel. And, of course, it's a, a hard plastic that can just come off. I'm pretty sure the scarf can come off on both of them. I'm not going to do that though. Articulation. Arms can swing. Head can spin. The articulation a little bit in the ears. So you can have them. Join go back and forth there. Jaw opens and closes so you can have them singing. You got a joint at the elbow, the wrist, his legs, knees, and at the ankle, waist. <clears throat> Get a good look at them there, though. They have a little cutout so you can kind of place the accessories on their head. <clears throat> it's not really cooperating with me, though. Take a look at the other guy. His is a, a little easier to put on, it's got the same. And his head fell off. So that's fun. Of course, if their head comes off, you can take the scarves and all that good stuff off. But you can just pop it back on. It's good as new. Articulation is the exact same with the other. Accessories. You've got a little candy cane that they can't really hold. Gingerbread man. Hope you guys can see that. Here's the candy cane again. And 
And last but not least with the uh, accessories. <laughs> Got the, the carol book with the music notes. It's plain blue paper on the back. Had it upside down. Um, if any of you can read music out there, it would be really cool if this uh, this read out the Gremlins theme, which is, if you remember, the scene in the movie when the caroling Gremlins were up there, they were singing the main theme. Alright, so this video is kind of all over the place. Um, rating? Uh, I'm going to start doing a rating system. So um, bear with me. I'm not really fond of rating systems or whatnot, but if I'm going to review them, I think it's fair that I rate it on some sort of scale. Um, the figures themselves, I, I absolutely love them. Like I, I love all of the the NECA Gremlins figures, the Gizmos, Mogwais, Gremlins. Um, so I mean. I can't really find a fault on them. So, I mean, they vary figure to figure, I know, with uh, paint application, but I've, I've never had anything that I could complain about truthfully from NECA as far as paint. I know with Godzilla, the eyes are a bit iffy, but check out these guys, their face. Even with him, I mean, the eyes are on point, they're not wonky, you don't have one looking that way, another one looking up or anything like that, which is what you'd find in some of the Godzillas, but um, there's no paint blotches, no dripping, nothing's rubbing off, so I mean, I would I would give the, the figures, I mean, I could probably do with a little bit more articulation. If they added, you get a lot of accessories in this pack. If they added some swappable hands, maybe, so they could hold all of the accessories, you know, a little bit easier. It's really the only thing that I could nitpick about. But other than that, pretty solid figures, man. Like, I would give them a, a 9 out of 5. 9.5. I mean, I don't know if you want to give not having the ability to hold the accessories a whole point but yeah um, accessories again I mean they can't really hold them you can kind of whatever but um The hats, I think if they had these like a cloth, you know, for the price point, these guys are on the $50 mark. Um, but you get a lot with them and they're good figures. But if these were a cloth and could fit a little bit better, this one's okay. Like I said, this kind of forms to the top of his head like that. But, um,. This one, kind of, you know, it's a little bit funky. Um, if they had cloth accessories, I think I would rate the accessories a little bit higher. So, overall, I would give this set a good 7.5 out of 10. Definitely worth picking up. If you happen to see these guys in the shelves or in the stores on shelves, I gotta tell you, when I got mine, it took a few trips to Target, and I had to go to three different Targets to finally find them. But they're there. You just have to look, pick them up. Definitely worth adding if you're if you're a fan of Gremlins. Gremlins is one of my favorite movies. Um, definitely up there. Uh, if you guys got them. Let me know what you think. Do me a favor and like, comment, share, subscribe, and 
His head fell off again. Is that going to be a thing with this? Maybe I should have added a point for that. Uh, I'm going to make a diorama of like a, a Christmas village set with the gremlins. I've got Stripe, the gamer gremlin, Gizmo. So, like, comment, share, subscribe. And if I get enough likes, comments, a general interest of it, I'll go ahead and I'll, I'll make a video showing how I put that Christmas village together. And let me know what you guys think. Until next time, peace.